So can I just say, I was completely terrified watching oh the movie yesterday because I was at the screening. Is it easier for you to watch it or actually be in it? Like, which one's more scarier? It's, okay, well, easier and scarier, two different things for me. So mm -hmm. it's a lot easier for me to, like, be in the movie e mm -hmm. e easily. And yeah. It's not easier to watch it. Okay. So watching it, I'm, like, just the consummate, like, actor artist so I'm like oh man I could have done this mm -hmm. I could have gone there how that worked out like you're always like looking at your performance so it's mm -hmm. harder to watch um, scary it's scary to watch with an audience mm -hmm. because you get wrapped up in the fanfare because yeah, yeah. you guys just go ah, ha, ha, ha. like it's just this whole thing mm -hmm. that just it transfers. It's a mm. big transference of energy. So, word on the street is you went to drama school, Lupita. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, do you feel more comfortable having uh, someone that you know personally as your on-screen wife? Yes, yes, it yes. It was. We had a great shorthand. We felt really comfortable, and it felt safe to just do the work that, you know, I had at hand, and it's great. And I remember after Black Panther we were like having, or during Black Panther, we were having dinner one time. And I just said, I can't wait till you're the lead in a movie, like for you to be leading movies and showing them, you know, what I've seen in school. Yeah. And she's like, you're up from your lips to God's ears, man, I can't <laughs> wait. So just to be able to do this with her has mm -hmm. been the biggest blessing. Amazing. In the trailer, the way you tap the bat saying, if you want to get crazy with this, we can get crazy with this. It's not completely the same yeah. as what it was in the film. So how do you portray like the different kinds of comedy? Like how do you know what kind of comedy is right for mm -hmm. a particular scene? Because horror and comedy is kind of different. Well, to be honest, it's, um, it's just something that I had to also work out with Jordan Peele and, mm -hmm. you know, trust his expertise in that. Mm -hmm. area because he comes from that sketch comedy background mm -hmm. with key and peel so i was like is this funny and the best thing was looking up and seeing him double over laughing mm -hmm. while i'm doing some of those scenes um also just negotiating what's necessary functionally for the film knowing that some of that is happening when one part of the film is transitioning to the other part of the film so like what it's functionally doing really helps. And out of the two between Gabe and Abraham, which one was more difficult to be? And did you do anything to kind of get yourself into the character of both of them? Um, Abraham was more difficult to live in, period. Mm -hmm. Like it took a lot of psychological just preparation to really yeah. live in that skin for extended yeah. time. Mm -hmm. um, and it would take a lot out of you. And it would take a lot of just like, while you're in it, keep prepping while in it. It yeah. would color everything that you did. Gay was fun because it was all spontaneous, spontaneous um, uh, interaction and really reactionary. So mm -hmm. anything could turn into a thing, you know, and he could find humor or jokes or this or that out of almost anything. And mm -hmm. it was always like looking for the thing that I could have fun with. Mm. So I enjoyed both of them, but they were really different. Getting into them, I worked with a dramaturg to really understand the world, and once I understood the world that we created, I could really give them point of view on the world and really have the world affect them, mm -hmm. and that really informed me. And looking just from my own perception from the movie, it's kind of based on your own fear, like looking at yourself as a mm. fear. So have you ever kind of got any fears that you kind of see in yourself? No, 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 no. I try to be very fear averse. Mm -hmm. Like I used to be really shy, and mm. that was a, a big fear that you know I'd never get over that. I still can sometimes be really awkward, you know? Um, <laughs> I love awkward I've met, people. yeah, yeah I've Isn't met it? really, like, uh, I've met some f famous folks that I didn't expect to meet and just was, mm -hmm. like, tongue-tied, you know <laughs> what I mean? Um, so I think maybe my fear isn't, it's not like the, that kind of crazy fear, mm -hmm. but it's, it's something a little bit more broad. Broad, mm -hmm. yeah. Thank you very Thank much. You.